Hello, all you fellow musicians and gamers out there. This is Quiana Gamer here, and I am here with the final part of my Let's Play of Star Wars Battlefront 2. Yes, ironically, at the beginning of 2019, we are putting things to an end. So, here is the final mission Hoth, our finest hour. The rebel outpost has been discovered and will be destroyed. Galactic peace is at hand. We shall see what happens. So, let's attack. And we're going to get to see clips from The Empire Strikes Back as well. Oh, so many good times. Uh, the Empire Strikes Back is one of my favourite Star Wars movies. Maybe not my absolute favourite, but it's definitely up there. So, the final mission of Star Wars Battlefront 2. And also, guys, at the end of this mission, I do have an, an announcement to make, actually. I might as well make it now, actually, a little bit of the announcement. This is not the final video you will see of Star Wars Battlefront 2. I do plan on making a bonus part of Star Wars Battlefront 2. And I'm going to be putting up a poll as well of what you want me to do in the bonus part regarding this match that I'll be doing. But I'm going to talk about more of that later at the end of the mission. So for now, here's the prologue to the mission. No one ever complained about the cold on Hoth. We never felt it. Even though we were blinded by blizzards, we could see the final end of the rebellion in our blaster sights. Was it only a mirage, perhaps? But on that day, on that planet, our blood ran hot with dreams of victory, melting the ice that stood in our way. Right then, so let's do there this. There is no tomorrow, men. Today we crush the rebellion once and for all. You know the orders. Destroy the shield generator in preparation for Lord Vader's arrival. Next, focus all efforts on preventing the final transport ship from lifting off. We'll begin by taking over their Outlook command post. Move out. Alright, thank you, Commander, for your uh, input on that. So basically, the reason why I like this mission a lot is because you're using AT-ATs to destroy the rebels. And I'm just trying to aim at them as much as I can here, but do you know what? I think it would be much easier now if I went on my foot here, because I've actually now destroyed, okay, maybe not all of the uh, the tanks, but I've destroyed most of them. And as you notice as well, we got a time limit to complete this mission, so 20 minutes. So that should be enough time, I think, to get things done. Or I think, uh, if I remember correctly, I actually know it's, it's 20 minutes to actually get uh, something done particularly. Okay, crap. Well, maybe you need to shoot more guys. But I agree, we do need more troopers like like me. Crap, and I'm low on health as well. Can I... Okay. Can I please... Okay, thank God. Okay, I've got a little bit more health. Right, who's contesting it? Ah, it's you. Right, I'll take you out. Come on. Why were you not shooting me? Okay. That was kind of weird. Right, anyway. So... Yes, let's do that indeed. Let's get some more ammo first, though, before we do that. And more health as well. Thank goodness for that. I think I would be more quicker going on foot to these bases. I could go in the AT-AT, -AT, but unfortunately... Oh, yes, and I've got the... Finally, I get to show this off. If you get so many kills, you get an award rifle, which is basically this. You shoot so many bullets at once, and they're much more powerful than your regular rifle. I can't believe this never popped up for me throughout the ledge play until now that... Oh, God damn it! And it's gone now. Thanks a lot. And the camera kind of shook weirdly there, which is kind of odd. Doesn't matter though, we've still got plenty of reinforcements at hand, so as long as you keep pushing forward, we we shall take this command post. I'm kind of thankful that we don't have snow like this in Scotland. Kind of reminds me of the time we had snow back in March. Nah, I'm overreacting of course. Come on, go down please, thank you. Right. Alright, I'm trying to sneak my way past these tanks. I don't want anybody destroying me. I don't want any snipers taking me out either. Oh crap, and I, what did I just say? What did I just say? Don't take me out, and you nearly destroyed me. Oh crap, no, really? 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 Another sniper? Oh god damn it. That's another one gone. Oh, come on. I really hope I don't fail this because of freaking snipers. I'm kind of tempted to use a sniper myself, or play as a sniper rifle guy myself. Right, see that vanguard, right, take you down. You're going to be a menace. Right, there we go. 
Right, marksman, take you down here. And you've not got any health, have you? Damn it. Okay, someone's trying to snipe me from behind. Oh, crap. Oh, my God, right. Come on, I can do this. I can do this. How did I manage to capture the first command post of so many problems? Oh, wait, I think I know why. It's because I used the AT-80, didn't I? Why am I not doing that now? Right, you're going down. I kind of wish they had a reinforcement count as well to make this fairer, but I guess that's not the case. Okay, come on. We can push through. We can do this. Right, come on. I can do this. Just keep going. Keep pushing forward. No! No, come on. Give me health. Yes! Thank God. Right, get in there. Get in there. Get in there. Right. No, no, damn it! Do you know what? Actually, no. Screw it. I'm taking the AT-AT. -AT. Sorry. But this is the only way I think I'm actually going to be able to get this command post properly. And it's very slow at turning around, apparently. Oh, yeah, I think we may fail here, actually. Yeah, I'm going to have to do this, unfortunately. Just take out all the rebels in there. Crap, is somebody destroying our... Right. I'm taking out all those things as well. There we go. Right, destroy the ground there. Right, there we go. Right, now, please, can I take this command post without any problems? I've destroyed near about all their defences, so it's about time. And I'm running out of time as well. And reinforcements, not to mention. Right, please, can I take this command post without any problems? Oh my god, we're near about failing here. Oh my god, come on, there better not be any rebels spawning here. Oh no, there is! Crap, take you down. Oh no! We're about to fail! Come on, take it, take it, take it, come on! Yes, there we go. All units ready to Thank god. The attacks will take point on the attack. Them it's really called the... It really should be called AT-ATs, not ATATs. I don't understand why they couldn't use the... I mean, I don't know what's wrong with AT-ATs, because isn't, isn't that what they're technically called? I'm pretty sure that's what they're called anyway. Thank God. That's what I should have done in the first place, use an AT-AT to take out the base. Right. I'm just hoping that the base isn't far away, so that's what I've got to destroy next. I'm hoping that the reinforcement kind will hold out long enough. Unfortunately, though, I couldn't really kill myself because I don't want to cost a, a team of reinforcement. Because one reinforcement can make all the difference. Or one respawn, should I say, should make, can make all the difference. Right, okay, come on. Let's go, go, come on. There we are, right. Where's our shield generator? There it is. Now let's take that out. Okay, if I can shoot that. How am I not locking onto that? That's kind of weird how I'm not locking onto that. It's kind of... Why am I not hitting that? That should be hitting. Oh, come on. Oh, there we go. Now we're finally locking onto it. When I should have been locked onto it there. Okay, come on. We're nearly there. Just keep using those green glass to take it down. We're nearly there. Yes. This will be just like the movie as well. There we go. The mag target. Maximum firepower. Maximum firepower. That's it. And use the clip to show it. Damn. There it goes. The shield generator is down. The rebel shield generator.
Ranger had been reduced to rubble. Ready the ground troops for the assault on Echo Base. Right, so now it's time to go to Echo Base. So we've got 12 minutes left to do to complete this mission. So I've got to capture yet another command post. And I've got plenty of reinforcements now to do this. So hopefully this time this should not be a fail. I was kind of hoping I would play as Darth Vader to make this easier, but I guess not. Okay, just turn away. Alright, take out that marksman. I've had enough of you sniper guys. There we go. War hero. Okay, I haven't got any... Okay. Right, so I've got to go through the... Okay, crap, right, now I need to run. I need to run, like, as fast as I can. Can I not play as Darth Vader? Okay, right, I need to actually take out... Actually, I'm going to respawn, actually. I'm going to kill my current player just now. Because I want to see if I can play as Darth Vader. Why is it not offering me that choice? Okay, I guess it has not offered... Really? It was all the way over there? Oh, what a waste of time that was. And waste of reinforcements. Right, so now I should be able to play as Darth Vader, I'm hoping. Okay, I got shot there, but somehow didn't lose any health. Okay, so I need to take this command post. Okay, just go. Crap. Oh, I think I got a few people with that grenade there. Okay, I can't play as Darth Vader. What the hell? I thought I could play as him at this point. You mean to tell me I can't? I cannot play as Darth Vader. That is actually kind of ridiculous. I mean, surely that they should offer that. Because, I mean, normally at this point, Vader would be landing and taking out the command post. Because the Millennium Falcon should be here. I think. Normally the Millennium Falcon... Oh wait, no, maybe the Millennium Falcon is not in this bit, actually. Right, okay. Let's take him out. Mm, no, how about you shoot some more? Maybe I don't hog all the troops for you. Crap. Right, okay. No, no! Oh, damn it. Come on, really? You see, this is what is so frustrating, because I'm the only one who can capture this command post. The other guys just stand there and do nothing and die. It's just so, so, oh, aggravating, if you ask me. And I'm probably going to end up failing now as a result of this. And I'm probably going to have to cut this to the point where I actually do end up getting there. And if I do play as Darth Vader, then yeah, the game's screwed around with me. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, you... God's sake. Right now, and before I go in there, I'm actually healing up on the medical droid. I don't care if I'm wasting time. That sniper took it near about all my health. I might as well do this. Oh, thank you, mate. Thank you, mate. I'm actually kind of happy that somebody did that for me. Go back. Well, thank you. That's another compliment another soldier has thrown at me today. <laughs> Come on, no, 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 come on, really? Oh, for fridge cake's sake. Yes, I said that right, for fridge cake's sake. Very, very good saying there. Fridge cake, I could possibly go for one of those as a reward for beating Hoth. Very ironic indeed, considering it's very cold. I'd have a cold treat afterwards. Yep. I think it's safe to say that, that this isn't going to end up in failure because because of the amount of reinforcements we have left. Mainly. It's not so much the time limit I'm concerned about, it's more that the reinforcements. Right, come on. Please take this command post without any problems. No! Get away from me. Get your health. No. No, 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 no. There's worse time to reload. It's that point. No! You need to get in here and help me out, guys. I'm not blooming lazy. I'm not... Oh, crap. Yes, I know. I need to watch my... No, no! Come on. Okay. Come on. 
I'm barely scraping back to this mission here. Thank God. Right, there we go. Now I can play as Darth Vader. Now I should be able to get past this with... So now I need to actually make my way around there now. Wait a minute, where do I go? Where do I go actually? That is a good question. Um Oh wait, I go this way. God damn it, really? Okay, now I'm on a really, really good time limit here. Watch that lightsaber. The rebel shields are deactivated. Moving on to capture the back hangar in preparation for our assault on the rebel transport ship. Right, okay. Now I need to go through here, I think. Crap! Oh crap, I'm taking it my own guys! Oh, am I going the wrong way? Might be. Oh, I am definitely going the wrong way. Oh no! Return to battle. It's like Vader's running away from the battle. He doesn't want anything to do with this. He's like, screw this crap. I'm out of here. <laughs> You suddenly got Jedi instincts within you again, Vader. Only now that you're doing that. Yep, our reinforcements are nearly dead. Crap. Yep, we're done. We're done. There's no way. No, 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 no. Oh, how the hell am I still alive? I'm still alive. Oh no. Come on, if I can take this command post as quickly as possible, I can still do it. Darth Vader. Yes, it's me. How do you do? I'm uh, here to greet you with a lightsaber. How the hell am I st No. Right. You are blocking that. Same with you. Get out of my way. You are also blocking the command post. Keep on feeding me more rebels, it'll keep me alive. Your strength is nothing. Compared Nothing to compared to the dark side. It's kind of a shame that James... Like, I mean, I know I said this before, but it's kind of a shame that James Earl Jones did not uh, end up voicing Vader in this game, because it would have been much better. Uh, come on, no, no! No, who's interfering now? Oh, you are, Mr. Marksman. There we are. Okay, another cutscene. And there goes the Millennium Falcon. Oh, good, we've got extra troops. Right, there we go. Oh crap! It is done, Darth Vader has fled. Okay. Well, at least I've still got plenty of time. Plus, I've got the. I'm kind of hoping I play as Vader again, but there's no way. I don't think that's going to happen now. Oh, that's a shame because I was really hoping I could actually. Have... That's what I get for trying to actually explore. But oh no! Place the beacon under the transport. Oh no! Now, how long have I got to defend this? This is another defending one, isn't it? Excellent. Now protect the beacon while we lock in your current position. Hit the dirt now! Watch those blasters! Oh no, 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 no. We're done. There's no way. No, no. Oh, no, you're st- Oh, no, no, no. Fudge calls, no. <laughs> We're done. Watch your fire. How? No, no. Grenade. No. Get away from there. How the hell? No. Oh my god. No, no. No, oh my god. No. We're dead. Oh, right at the end. Oh, that was. Oh. Oh, that is such a damn shame. The final objective, and I failed. Oh my god, really? I was so close. Do you know who I really should have gone? I really should have gone the engineer. Why? Because he probably could have repaired the beacon uh, as he went. 
or I really should have gone as Darth Vader if I still survive long enough. All right, guys, right, I'm going to have to cut here, so I'll see you in a bit when I come back Over with the final objective. Rebel scum. An orbital strike beacon has been placed in the hangar for you. Acquire the beacon and place it under the transport ship. Command will use the coordinates from the beacon to launch a massive attack from above. Failure is not an option. I have finished my master. Okay guys, right, I'm back. So, it's now time to play as an engineer this time around. Why I say that? Because I'm gonna damn well need this, because... I know that the rebels are going to use all explosives possible to destroy this. I'd rather die many times trying to get this in the right place, rather than failing right there and then. Right, actually, do you know what? Get myself health, so I'll need it. There we go. Excellent. Now protect the beacon while we lock in your current position. Okay, here we go, guys. Right, so just keep unlocking on to this. Crap! No! No, 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 no. Imperial officer, go, 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 go. Right, go, 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 go. Get in there. No, 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 no. What die, the die, hell die. am I doing? Come on, 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 can I hold out? Can I hold out? Can I hold out? No, it's not going to hold out, is it? Oh my god, yes. Thank god. Yes. Thank god. Sorry about my overreaction, guys, but that was extremely close. I was thinking to myself, please do not let me have to do that for a second, third time again. <laughs> Right, here's the final cutscene. Star Destroyer looms over the transport, and the transport is not away. It is the first transport is destroyed. Holy crap! As the rebels fled, the 501st gathered around a burning bunker and let out a cheer that shook the stars. The rebellion was done. The Death Star was being rebuilt bigger than ever. Order had finally returned to the galaxy. In no small part due to the efforts of the fighting men of the 501st. Right, all I can say, guys, is thank God that that's over. Because, uh, honestly, I did not want to have to cut this video again for the second time. So, thank goodness that's done. So, that was the final mission of the Empire, uh, Rise of the Empire. So... I believe it may be the credits next, which gives me the opportunity to talk about this. Let's see if it is next. The credits. Is, I mean, I know that this is a final mission. I just want to make sure that this is the credits coming up. Let's see if this is true or not. It is indeed. All right, guys. Well, this will give me an opportunity to talk about this bonus part I mentioned at the beginning of this video. So basically, what I'm going to be doing, actually, I'll actually, do you know what I might do? Skip the credits film. I'm actually going to show you this. I'm actually going to show you the uh, what exactly I'm going to be planning on doing for the bonus part. Instead of telling you about it, I'll show you. So yes, I'm going to save that. Yes, I know I already exist. I'm talking right now. So anyway. Uh, okay, so what I'm going to do, guys, is this. So if I go into instant action, so here's what I plan on doing for the bonus part. It'll be Moss Isley, Assault Mode, Galactic Civil War. But this is going to be Heroes vs. Villains. So basically, I'll give you a little preview of it actually. So I'll launch it right now and I'll show you what it actually is. I'm pretty sure it's Heroes vs. Villains in the way on this mode. Yeah, because... Uh, I'll let it load just now and, let, and uh, just see what's going on with it. So... 
that's pretty much uh, what's going to be happening here. Heroes vs. Villains. So the poll I'll be putting up is this. Uh, if you want me to play as the heroes, then please vote for heroes. If you want to see me play as the villains, then please vote for villains. So I'll be putting that poll up on my Twitter and my Facebook, as well as, I mean, uh, if I'm talking about the YouTube Premiere feature that I'm plan on, planning on using, then uh, feel free to uh, basically state in the live chat what you want me to do. So here you go, heroes or villains. So that's pretty much it, guys. So uh, on that note, I'll leave that for now. So thank you very much for watching this Let's Play. And uh, I hope you all enjoyed it. Please feel free to like if you enjoyed it. Comment down below with your thoughts. And please be sure to hit that subscribe button for future Let's Plays coming up on my channel. I'm not going to reveal what Let's Plays I've got coming up next, but you'll see what they are. You'll be surprised. Till then, guys, ho hope you all have a great day wherever you are. And I shall speak to you later when I come back with more Let's Plays and videos in general. Hope you have a good day and goodbye.